turning cars here. Thank you. See, like, that's confusing. Europe is known for their trains. Carrying about 40 pounds on my back. I don't know the names. I'm like okay. extremely American. I have like a few hours layover, so. so we're gonna explore a little bit. It's windy. It's a little bit of a dreary day. They have pretty nice bike lanes here. They are unprotected from cars, but cars, left, left, thank you, but cars seem to be a little extra sensitive, but it's weird, like, the bike lanes turn into middle lanes out of nowhere, and then it turns back, so like, I don't know if this is a bike lane right now, I don't really know the flow out of the city quite yet, so not trying to not trying to do anything crazy. It looks like the bike lane has re-emerged, but it's turning. So the bike lane is gone. So which is just confusing. Uh, there's a bike lane on the other side of a one-way street, which is just weird. Turning cars here, so hopefully we got some cobblestones up here, which is going to be brutal. Oh, that's the European history we're looking for, eh? Here we go. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my bad. Oh, they stop for pedestrians here. Oh yeah, no, that's nice. I like that. Hey, they got e-bikes here too. This is a two-way bike lane, but cars, uh, see, like that, if you have to cross a bike lane as a car, that's kind of odd to me. And now I don't know where it goes. Oh, this looks like a cute street. That's bike lane going this way, but it's against traffic. weird to me. Should I try to read the street? Sternstraf? Is that an F or a B? Roast me in the comments. This guy's gonna parallel park. I just wanted to be careful with my backpack there. But other than that, I knew I was good. Even if there isn't a bike lane, I see a lot of people on the road in their bikes. Look at this kid. These kids, they a cargo bike. Beautiful. This is a very skatable city, which is lovely, and I quite like it. It's yellow, and then it hits green, but I'm gonna pass this guy because he's slow. I don't want to T-bone on a truck. We got headwinds. It's not nearly as hectic as New York, obviously. Check this out though, this is beautiful. Same light for cyclists. And here's what I mean, how it's a little confusing. I don't know if it's a green for cyclists. Or not, we're just gonna send it and turn it going both ways, but small. That's crazy, and against traffic. Interesting. Thank you. This will take me to where I want to go. 
the legality of it is another question. Ooh. This is like a mandatory one hit. Ah, there's like so many unreal spots here. Put my bag down. Please don't get my bag. Whew. A great hit. Trash, but I gotta go back to the airport. To the gold mine. Gold mine. Should I skate to the airport? Okay, yeah, we're just gonna skate to the airport. The delivery trucks here are also double parked. I feel so at home. And this is a turning lane. This is what doesn't make so much sense to me. Sorry, on your left. Ooh. See, like, that's confusing. Everything's in kilometers. So we're taking this for 2.1 kilometers and then hanging left. This cab wants to pull over here. Left, thank you. Thank you. And we got the train. Let's see if we can beat this European train. I mean, Europe is known for their trains. So I probably don't have a chance, but we're gonna give it our best shot. Oh, we're beating the train. Take this to the main river. On your right here, on your right, thank you. Let me just end here. Okay. Not really sure where to go here. I, I see this bike lane, so I'm just gonna follow it. Hopefully I can take a shower before my flight. That would be lovely. 600 meters. Okay, it's just, it's just the bike lane just ends. There's no warning. There's a sign. And then it just ends. Let's see. 20 meters. Okay, I'm hitting a left here. So we have to make a right here. And I'm, I'm assuming I'm going up. It's so slippery here. Great for bikes. Not so much for rollerblades, I will say. So 200 meters. Now it's a hill and it might be slick. Okay. Yeah, it's slippery right there. We got one more slippery part. Let's not try to turn sharply. Okay, so we have to go here. Okay, so we're on the other side now. Are they rowing? That's cool.
skate in the street. If I have any problems, I'll hop onto the bike lane, which is just like this. These like humpy cobblestone. Thank you. These people probably think I'm crazy. Four kilometers out. We got a bike lane. Look at that. European infrastructure for the win. I think. Uh, no, it just ends right there. So I'm gonna hustle until a car comes and then I'll hop, hop in there. I wish I had my race wheels right now, let me tell you. That's very slick. You got it. I'm sorry I'm slow. <laughs> that was very polite. I'm carrying about 40 pounds on my back. No. Is this gravel? I think this is gravel. How long is it like this? I'm gonna ask this person. Two kilometers. Hey, excuse me? Is it gravel all the way down? Sorry? Um, is it gravel all the way down? Yes. Is it, is there an or did they have to head over to the airport? Um, so it's completely down until the airport like this. Okay. And where do you come from now? Um, I was in the city center. So from Niederrad? I don't know the names. I'm like okay. extremely American. <laughs> I have like a few hours layover, so. Okay. Um, yeah, it's easy to go this direction. Okay. Uh, let me, yeah, there are streets going back to the airport. So I would have to cut... I'm assuming that's a highway, and yeah, right. um, I don't want to. I'll stop recording. I'm sorry. We really don't have an option as far as heading to the airport. Some places it's a little bit more wet, but uh, I I have to do what I got to do. Uh, I'll probably ruin my bearings. It's not terrible, I'm just worried about hitting something and getting stuck. But it's about two kilometers down. So, harder. Definitely a workout. That kind woman um, said that it's like this the whole way down. So, I'm optimistic. This is a little bit better. We're good. Okay, it's getting better. Hopefully, my bearings aren't completely ruined. Oh, these look like cobblestones, but they're actually pretty jagged. That's probably where the train goes. Oh, oh! Those were extra rough. 400 meters. These meters, man. Like I. I like I know how how long a meter is, but in, like in context, no idea. Like clueless. Under a kilometer away, which is a thousand meters, I think. Hello, I'm on your left. Thank you. Ah, oh, this is terrible. Ugh. It's taking me the wrong way. This guy is going to look. Okay. Thank you. The airport is over there. Little one cargo center. That's where we want to go. I think it'll take me to that place we're gonna go underneath the tunnel. And I don't think it's meant for cars. And I hope there are no cars going coming this way. And if there are, I'll just dive into the bushes. This road. See ya. Bridge. And then I should be there. I think we made it. 
get uh, to the airport. I don't know if anyone has ever arrived at the airport in rollerblades, but this is my method of transportation. Uh, we're going to pick up the bags, and I think pretty sure where where we need to be. We made it. All right, so I obviously really want to roll on these glorious floors, but um, I'm in a foreign country and I want to, to I don't want to ruffle the feathers too much. I don't really know the consequences, so I'm uh, not going to take any chances and I'm going to switch over to my shoes, my on-cloud dad shoes, which are so comfortable. Big fan. Came here, had a few hours, attached my bag. You can leave it here for wherever you like. It costs a little bit of money, but it's a great way to do it. And here it comes. Thank you. Okay, I want to make it clear. I am definitely not a travel blogger, but six euros, you can shower in the Frankfurt airport real quick. Yeah.